Hey, yo, this basketball drill right here is nuts. Right, this man, Pete Maravich is going to teach us how to do some basketball drills yeah, to get our dribbling be skills better, bro. R.I.P. the legend of Ray Arbeck and Pete Maravich, man. R.I.P. So both of them legends, he's man. From the time he, was a little bitty one. he said he's been doing this since he was a kid. All right, let me see what you're talking about, life, man. But a part of his hand. Now, you see that little drill he did there? Oh, I saw it all right. But it has meaning. Everything he does has meaning. What about that drill, Pete? Man, they gonna show it in slow motion, bro. Look at this drill he doing, bro. What's this drill called? The nutcracker? This is a nutcracking drill, bro. Make sure you don't have no kids in the future. Ain't yeah, nobody doing this drill. No, it ain't no bullet ricochet, bro. It's the nutcracker, bro. Get it right. Because if you do, you open up a pocket under there and you might end up... Where you don't want to end up. Which is another way of saying you ain't gonna have no kids in the future. This is coordination. Bro, nobody is doing that, bro. Watch it very closely. That's asking to have your 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 nuts crushed, bro. Pulverize. Ain't nobody doing all that. Continually increase your speed and continue increase. Bro, nobody's doing that, bro. Why are you gonna start slamming it to the ground? You know, you know what's crazy. One mistake. And you wiped out your whole bloodline, bro. It's over with. <laughs> you could have not had kids in the future. <laughs> oh, what? Yeah, bro, what's, what's good with these drills, Pete? What, what you got going on naming these drills, bro? Again, utilizing all your wrists. Now, this looks very simple, but when you don't move your feet, it's very difficult. And you just keep throwing it back until you master Just keep throwing it back, y'all. Make sure when you clap those thighs, you throw it back. That's how you. That's how you really get into it. Here, throw the ball about five or six feet in the air. I'm gonna clap my thighs once, catch it behind my back twice. Oh, it's not simple enough. Okay, let me see. Let me see that thing right there, bro. Let me see it. That's one. Okay. Two. Oh no! This see this right here. This actually do take hand eye coordination. I thought he was talking about something else. That's how he watches the ball. Well, duh. What else he gonna watch, Red? What you talking about? Hey, yo, he's good at throwing it back and clapping those thighs, bro. Nah. You might even say he's a professional clapper. Ten. How do you like that? Now, you notice how he watched the ball on that all the time? His wrists, his coordination. His okay, Ray, you, you gassing the drill. He threw the ball behind his back and caught it over and over. We, okay, and he added some thigh slaps to it. Like, okay. It, it's not that crazy. Very uh, difficult, uh, but develops extremely quick hands. I'm scared to hear what the drill calls after the first two drills. How to drill the ball is what I call a knee clap. Now, the knee clap. This is another level right here, man. If you if you know how to clap your knees together while you throw it back, oh, you a pro. You a pro at that point. And try to catch the ball before it hits the ground. You have to utilize a lot of quickness on this drill. You heard him now. Make sure you do it fast. You know, you want to maintain a nice rhythm and maintain your speed when you're making the clap. Do this a couple times. Is this a drill, bro? This shit looks easy as hell. Oh, this is okay. This is the drill. Oh, I thought he was talking about something else again. My bad, y'all. That's beautiful. That's beautiful. And all of these. Drills, Did we really need this camera angle, y'all? Like we had the perfectly good camera angle facing forward. We didn't need a side profile of Pete Maribus doing this drill, bro. Like, what's going on with y'all? Know, a large part of my game mainly because when I was a junior in high school I was yeah speaking of which what the fuck does any of these drills have to do with basketball in what situation are you going to need to clap your hands together and, and make sure you twirl the ball around your kneecaps and catch it again in, a, in, a, in an NBA game or are you going to need to throw the ball behind your back over your head and clap your your hands on your thighs what is what is that doing for basketball bro they go that nutcracker again. I may, you know, you could try this at home, or I, w I wouldn't recommend you trying this at home, you know. Protect your future generation down the line, you know. You want to keep the bloodline alive. You don't want to just decimate your whole bloodline because your, your finger slipped or something, you know. He's Pete Marvin.